We're celebrating our 10th anniversary this weekend, right? So I opened Pilar's in January 2013. I'd never worked in a restaurant. I'd never worked in a bar. I just thought this is what Winter Garden need. And when, when I thought about, you know, opening a martini bar in Winter Garden, uh, so many people said, oh, no one in Winter Garden drinks martinis. Has anybody in Winter Garden drank a martini before? <laughs> yeah, so that one we were. And then I said, let's open a jazz club upstairs. And they said, no one in Winter Garden will go to a jazz club. Let's we'll see. How many of you have been to a jazz club in Winter Garden now? <laughs> but I had a sense of humor. This is, this is fun, you guys. This is not brain surgery. Come in here, have a good time with your family, your friends. And when I talk about a perfect pair, that's our signature cocktail. It's a cocktail, I, I actually had a pear martini in New York once in like 2000 and I don't know, eight or something. And I was like, my mind was blown. I'm like, I love this martini. So I spent the next five years trying to figure out the perfect pear martini. Now, I'm gonna show you something right now that I have not, I've never done this on a mic before. So y'all just bear with me, you're getting something special here. When I talk about a perfect pear, this is what I mean. Pilar's has a big pear. Did you get it? Where's my drum roll? Some people have a posh pair because they make good money for it. Some people have a perky pair because we know what that looks like. Because they're So anyway, tonight, yeah, that's true too, I like that. I, I have added that. Tonight, I have brought back, what's it called? The salty pear. And that's in honor of my good friend, and, and advisor, uh, Per Danielson, he loves yeah. black licorice. I love black licorice. It's not a big seller, I have to tell you, I did take it off the menu. But if anybody would like a salty pear, we do have a few behind the bar. And I say raise a glass and let's toast to Per Danielson on his birthday and the salty pear. Thank you so much. Honestly, if you love licorice, you need to get up to the bar. You need to do that. But anyway, the last thing I want to mention before I'm here, uh, besides this being our 10th anniversary, the other person that was so important, I mean, a lot of people are important. Most of the people that play at Pilar's have played here since the very first year that we opened. It's a family. I support the musicians. I like it when they come to me and they say, we want to do this, and I'm like, okay. I'm not a musician. I'm not. I, I didn't know anything about any of this, but I just love my community.